This screencast segment will walk you through the advanced feature of building a custom or hybrid model for analysis. From the Use the Tool page, select the Create Custom Model tab at the top. A custom model can be used to develop a hypothetical product with direct purchasing demands from multiple specific sectors. In contrast, a hybrid model allows you to change the purchasing demands of a sector across the economy. These will become clear when we look at each model specifically. We'll start with the custom product. Begin by selecting the custom product option and a similar input page will open. First, we would choose the model year for analysis and then select the sectors that will be involved in producing your good or service. We will use the default year, 2002, for U.S. model. And as an example, we'll be doing a simplified analysis of an LED light bulb by selecting three specific sectors involved in production. We'll start by adding a sector like semiconductor and related device manufacturing for the LED wafer production. We then need to enter the economic activity demanded from this sector. Here we're going to input $1 million, and then we would click on Add This Sector so that it can be added to the current sectors along with the value demanded. Next, we'll add lighting fixture manufacturing for the fixture components of the bulb and setting the economic value to $0.2 million. And add the sector. Finally, we will add other pressed and blown glass and glassware manufacturing and set an economic value of $0.1 million. And add the sector. You can see here all the current sectors listed along with their total values. And once we've finished adding all the required sectors, click on Build the Model and a similar results page will open. Here it'll list all of your current and their values, and then the results due to the impact category you select. You can change the inputs here, selecting a different input category and a different number of sectors, just like you could with a standard model. We will now look at creating a hybrid model. Back at the Use the Tool page, we can select Hybrid Product to bring up an input page that requires a model year and a sector group you would like to analyze. This is similar to the standard model, but after selecting your sector and inputting the economic activity demand of your sector, a page will open that will allow you to change the individual purchasing demands of your sector. If, for instance, you're analyzing a sector that uses significantly less energy than the industry average, you can input a new value for power generation and supply. Note that all values on this page are going to be represented in thousands of dollars rather than in millions. As an example, let's again consider automobile manufacturing. Selecting the sector, choosing, again, $2 million worth of economic activity. Choose the sector, and now you can see the page where you can change the individual purchases from each sector. As mentioned before, we could scroll down and look for power generation and supply listed here. Noticing that it has 40 listed as the hundreds of thousands of dollars, we could change this instead to requiring significantly less, roughly 35. Once this change has been made, we scroll to the bottom, click Continue, and a similar results page will come up with your current sector and also the change that was applied to that demand. Results can be analyzed and, displayed, and are displayed simply as the standard model is.